So, in this centromere is present, okay, it means close to that end. So, near to that end, centromere is form near to one end that's why so one arm is long another arm is short so that one arm is these are that arms so that one arm is long one arm is short okay so that is known as the submetacentric after that acrocentric In that centromere is formed, okay, closely near to that uh, one end. In this centromere is formed closely closely to one end so that is known as that acrocentric chromosome okay so after that telocentric in the telocentric chromosome completely centromere is present okay at the terminal position So, in this one, centromere is present. At terminal or complete end. Or complete end. That is known as the telocentric. So, in this one, telocentric, only one arm is participated. So, generally, it is arms are appear V shape. In this arms are appear. In that arms are appear V shape. So in that arms are appear L shape. In that arms are appear J shape. In arms are appear I shape. So total it is known as V L J I shape. So this V L J I shapes are appear at the time of uh, anaphase. Okay, so that is known as that depend upon the centromere chromosomes. Uh, okay, monocentric chromosomes are okay, four types depend upon that uh, location of centromere in chromosome. Monocentric chromosomes are divided into four types metacentric, submetacentric, acrocentric, after that, telocentric. After the next one, nucleosome. Nucleosome means chromatin is appear in nucleus beads on string. Beads on string. So chromatin appear beads on string-like structure in nucleus that is known as that nucleosome. 
each nucleosome is uh, is known as nucleosome so each nucleosome is is wrapped each nucleosome having 200 base pair of dna it is wrapped it is wrapped around that stone octamer stone octamer up to 2 tons up to 2 tons each octamer having each octamer having four types of histone proteins four types of histone proteins so each one having two copies four types of histone proteins they are H2A, H2B, H3, H4. Okay? Stone proteins each having two copies. Okay, so these are known as that octamer. They are having that uh, eight histone proteins. Okay, so the, this eight histone proteins. Okay, so that is known as that octamer or core. It is core or octamer. So H1 histone protein is present. So only it is that uh, single. So, where the DNA seals that stone octamer, enter and leave the DNA, H1 histone protein is present. For example, 